Another fuel spill sent hazmat teams to work in Marin County after a tanker truck crashed early this morning. This happened in San Rafael. Crews moved in quickly to keep the 500 gallons of fuel from running into a nearby creek. KTV's Tom Vakar tells us if the rain had moved in earlier today, it could have been a lot worse. About 2.30 early Tuesday morning, a double gasoline tanker carrying 9,000 gallons of fuel rolled the rear tank over as it turned on the Northgate Avenue to refuel some gas stations and started spilling some fuel. Had a spark ignited that fuel, it would have been a firebomb right next to several buildings in and around the Northgate One strip mall. The fact that we received the phone calls right away and that we were able to get here within minutes uh, and our fire department placing sand around the spilled fuel, I think mitigated a lot of the potential hazard. Nonetheless, that forced the closure of the eastbound lanes of Freitas Parkway, throwing a giant monkey wrench into the morning commute. I think we were very fortunate. The first order of business is to get the gasoline off the road. Empty the small pond of fuel that we have here along with the sand that was used to keep it from spreading. Even though the situation is stabilized and all the leaking has stopped, the truth is here in Santa Margarita Creek, the overwhelming smell is that of raw gasoline. As we know, uh, fuel and water don't mix, so it would have spread very quickly. Since there was no rain at the time, and crews immediately put down booms and huge absorbent pads for the second task, keeping any gas in the drains and the sewers out of the creek. Go into the storm drain where booms and pads have been placed to mitigate fuel spread. By mid-afternoon, the rolled trailer tank was hauled away by a huge tow truck to accommodate the cleanup. The cleanup will take hours. Northgate Drive will remain closed during that time, and we may be required to close down a small portion of eastbound Freitas Parkway between Las Galinas and Del Presidio as the cleanup expands. Had there been big rains when this happened, a lot of that gasoline would now be sitting in the bay. Tom Baker, KTVU Fox 2 News.